Venus and Fiona, read their bikes down the perfectly manicured path. What life potions do you think we'll get? You're so good with new children. I'm sure you're being nurtured. What about you? I don't think that's Finny in there. Jonas looks out the distant wall of the mist that surrounds the community. Do you ever wonder what Eltor is like? Is like? Why would I? The community just profits everything I need. But aren't you curious what's beyond the mist? Questioning the things is rude, Jonas. Inside his dwelling, Jonas joins his family unit for dinner, pre-made food on metal trays. It's time to share feelings. There is a new child in the nursery who is small and weak. It made me feel disappointed. What will happen to it? If he doesn't grow, he'll be really sales for here, turn Jonas. Well, I guess I'm sort of terrified. Precision of language. I mean, anxious about the ceremony. The elders will assign the right life potion for you. They would. They are never wrong. The community gathers in an amphitheater. As you know, once lived the chaos, then came a solution. Communities were disordered, became harmony. Harmony! Now that old had been released, it's time for the ceremony of it, of the grown. Jonas and the other 16-year-olds file onto the stage. Listen for your name. I will announce life positions. Matt made wine. Birth mother Isaac, instructor Asher, pilot Fiona, narrator Jonas. The chief elder pauses. A look of confusion passes over Jonas's face. Jonas, you have been chosen for our next receiver of memory. <gasps> the crowd begins to chant. Jonas, 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 Jonas. The next day, Jonas rides to the current receiver's dwelling, a strange stone building at the edge of the mist. Inside, Jonas stares in awe at towering shelves of books. An old bearded man watches him. These are your books now. In my dwelling, we only have a dictionary in the community's book of rules. I didn't know the other books existed. Books are forbidden. Why? Books introduce alternate ways of thinking. Then why does the receiver have them? The receiver holds all the memories of what life used to be like and uses them to give advice in times of need. Sit down. Jonas sits in an old wooden chair. I will transmit you, to you the memories I hold within me. You will learn the secret history of the world, generations back when things were different, when there was more. More? Much more. Violins, bumblebees, purple, thunderstorms. What are those things? We got rid of them when we embraced sameness. The giver holds Jonas's wrist. A shock travels through Jonas's body. Suddenly, Jonas is standing alone in the woods. Plump, white snowflakes drift around him. There is a crunch as Jonas takes a step in the thick snow. Jonas' eyes snap open. What was that? It's called snow. Did my parents have snow? Did you? No, this weather here is always the same. We're always pleasant because of climate control. Why? Snow is cold. It destroys crops, which brings hunger and starvation. Jonas thinks about this. If I'm the receiver now, what are you? That must make me the giver. At Jonas' toilet, father holds a tiny baby. Why does his name tag say uncertain? New children are not given names until they're placed with family units. We're going to take. We're going going to look at the, for this little guy until he gets bigger to be strong and happy a lot more. Well, yeah. To have really you. You looked at his name. Isn't that against the rules? It is, but I thought we have having a name might help. 
this little guy grow. Jonas reaches out, Gabriel wraps his tiny hand on Jonas's finger. Hey, Gabe. Okay. His name is uncertain. Jonas's training continues. In the past, everything had quite a color. They give her a taste Jonas's wrist. Jonas is on a red bow in the distance. Our green forest below the blue waters. Whoa, why don't we have colors anymore? We unlimited all differences. Differences can cause jealousy, anger, and hate. But colors are beautiful. We gained control of many things, but we had to let go of others. Jonas sees a map on the giver's desk. What's this area beyond the mist? It is a bound of memory forbidden, especially for you. Why? If the receiver of memory crosses the boundary, your memories will be set free and returned to the people. This is called music. Listen to what it calls from inside. Jonas is at a wedding. His wedding. He and the bride are dancing and laughing. My chest hurts, but it's good. That's called love. Why would they get rid of love? Because emotions can't be controlled. There's heartbreak, there's sorrow. I'll show you. Mother elephant feeds his baby in the windswept grasslands. Crack, crack, rifle shoot. The young elephant drops in agony. The mother roars with rage. Jonah opened his eyes. They were wet with tears. How can people be so cruel? People make bad decisions. You can see why the community wants to take away choices. If there is neither good nor bad, what is there? Good question. Jonah stands in the grass. Jonas, do you need help? Immediate help? No, I was just... Why are you smiling like that? This, the, li the leaves, your hair. What's going on with you? Jonas, Fiona, Oh, Fiona, Fiona, there is much more <coughs> to life. He begins stand and spin fun around. Mm -hmm. What are we doing? Oh, okay. You two are going back to the fast until they fall down laughing. It's a loud but... You got me in trouble, Jonas. Yeah. They loud. Good morning, issue Fiona. You got me in trouble, Jonas. It's called dancing. As the months go by, Jonas receives memories of skyscrapers, dinosaur skulls, and many other wonders. He also learns of war and destruction and loss. Tell me if any of this proves too much for you. I want to know everything. The giver pushes a button on the wall. Show this morning, Jillies. A screen appears. Appears. Jonas's father has placed twin babies on side-by-side -side scales. Okay, who's my chubby champion? The scales read 300 and 301. Father's assistant takes away the heavier baby. And you, Mr. One Unit Less. Bye bye, little guy. Father inserts a syringe into the baby's head and presses down. The screaming baby goes still. Jonathan and his family and I are having dinner. Father feeds baby Gabe. Enjoy it, baby Gabe. This is your last night here.
What do you mean? Uncertain failed his growing test. I have to release the little guy to elsewhere. Release him? When? Tomorrow morning. They're going to kill Gabe tomorrow. I'm fine. I'm leaving tonight and I'm taking him with me. I need to find the boundary of memory and cross it. The boundary is far away and you're not ready. Come with me. If the memories are released, chaos will return. I must stay to help the community. The giver grabs Jonas's wrist. Images flash of a man crossing a vast desert. A woman swimming through a mighty river. Jonas hears a long distance runner's footsteps pounding against the gravel. These memories will give you courage. Jonas's face is awash with emotion as the giver hands him the map. I love you, Jonas. Now go. Jonas takes the baby carol and hops on his bike. The chief elder's voice booms over the speakers. Pardon the receiver in training. Jonas pedals faster, dodging streetlights. The chief elder watches on a monitor. There's nowhere to hide, Jonas. We have cameras everywhere. Hold on, Gabe. Jonas speeds toward the wall of mist and punches through it, disappearing from sight. Release the drone planes. The chief elder storms into the giver's dwelling. You gave him that map, didn't you? I made it available. Jonas made a decision to restore people's freedom. Freedom? Imagine if we let people choose their spouse, their food, their job. They would choose wrong every single time. But we have stolen life from people. We are distant whispers of what wants man as human. We will find Jonas and we will stop him. Jonas now clutches Gabriel as he struggles up the mountain. The hum of planes get closer. Snowflakes begin to fall from the sky. We're almost there, Gabe. At the top, Jonas sees a bright red sled. He climbs on with Gabriel and pushes off. Whoosh! The sled picks up speed. Jonas wraps his arm around Gabriel. They rocket past the boundary of memory. Back in the community, Father pauses. He cannot bring himself to release the baby smiling up at him. Lily at school begins to hum a tune. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And Fiona opens her arms and begins to dance. 